Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy a really positive week. I'll be using my teacup tarot deck and later on, I will clarify with my time to shine deck. So have a really positive week. Let's get right on with your readings. So Sagittarius, your overall energy for this week is card 15, ego. And this reminds you to focus on positivity, optimism and confidence. And that's just what our angel's doing here, look. She's leaving behind these heavy rocks which are fear, stress, self-sabotage, and she's left those to one side because she's picked up the balloons, which are so much brighter and lighter, and she's focusing on those lovely qualities. And they are guiding her along. The road is clear now for her. So just be mindful to get your focus in a positive place this week. Your help or your hurdle, Part 10, the Wheel of Fortune comes in. So expect a positive move forward. Expect things that have perhaps felt a little bit delayed or a bit slow to start moving. And the important thing with this card as well is moving forward and taking with you your gifts, your talents, happiness, inspiration, positivity, love and joy taking all those qualities with you. Our guidance, the six of coins, asks you to pay attention because lovely gifts and opportunities are coming in to find you. It's the pennies from heaven card. Lovely angel thought it was raining and it wasn't. These were the gifts from the universe. So stay awake, things that you've been hoping to manifest lovely new opportunities coming in. It could be a new job, a new career, a new area of study. It could be a promotion and an increase in your wages. Stay awake for those. These opportunities are tumbling in to find you. How can we help ourselves? We have the magician card, card number one. This card says you are ready you have everything you need, go for it. And our lovely angels, look, they've taken the leap of faith and here they are with the balloons. They've got everything they need and they are flying high. They have the confidence, they've made that step forward and here's the success for them. Pulling it all together, the four of teacups reminds you to be mindful to look at the bigger picture, look at the whole picture. Our lovely angel here is so focused on these little teacups here in the past. She's missing this golden opportunity, which is right behind her. All she has to do is turn round. It's right there. Then she'll see it. So look at the big picture, step back, make sure you've got all the information because there's a golden opportunity here that you might be missing. So stay awake for that. We're talking about that here. Just be open and ready for these opportunities coming in to find you. And the outcome card is the page of coins. Now the pages are all messengers. They all have an envelope on the deck. Here, look. Now, this page reminds you to do the research, do the study and find out all the information. This is about being happy to learn. It could be a new area of study coming in for you. But generally, this card says, read it up, do the research, find all of your information before you're ready to make this move. Make sure that everything you need to know, that you have it all in front of you. Make the time to go and find it out. So let's just summarize. Focus on confidence, 
and positivity and optimism. Don't let self-sabotage or negativity hold you back or wear you down. Be ready to make you move forward with positivity on all your lovely gifts and talents. Opportunities are coming in. They're looking for you. Make sure you're looking for them. And yes, you are ready. You have everything you need. Have that self-confidence. Have that self-belief. And make sure that you're looking at the whole picture. The bigger picture. Take your time and get all the information. Do the study. Do the research. And when you have all that information, this lovely move forward, you'll be ready to make that move forward with ease and with grace. So let's just clarify with the Time to Shine deck. The three of action is about long-term plans. We're talking about that here, looking at all the options, dreaming big dreams, abundance coming in, making those new plans, staying positive and keeping moving forward. The four of emotion card, a double message here. It's the same card from a different deck. Time to look out for those wonderful new opportunities coming your way. Stand back, pay attention. These opportunities are in sight. They're looking for you. Make sure that you see them. And the two of wisdom card, this has come up for every reading so far virtually. Pause, think it through, do the research, do the study, get all your information. And when that's to hand, you can decide exactly what it is you want to do. Make sure it's going to be making you happy, making you feel good, and you be ready to make that new move forward for yourself. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button, make the bell ring. Then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.